Hey everybody, I'm Schmirket Aber, and it's a big day for Cotaber Farms here on Sundays at the Farm with Farmer Schmir uh, in Stardew Valley. It's the first of fall, and tomorrow is going to be beautiful and sunny. The fortune teller says that the spirits are very displeased today. Spirits have not been happy this last week, but we do have a living off the land. We're back again with another tip for y'all. Now listen up. If you manage to get your hands on a rare seed, now's the time to plant it. Although it's said to take all season to grow, reliable sources have told me it actually takes just 24 days. The end result is returned, is rumored to be the sweetest fruit in the entire world. Oh, baby, we're planting those for sure, because we do have some rare seeds. Okay. Dishmer, you're such a good neighbor, I thought I'd send over some animal feed to make your job easier. Keep it up, Marnie. Aw, oh, thanks, Marnie. Okay. Great. We've got a gold star mayonnaise to sell. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and grab out, um, oh boy. We need to grab out the rare seeds um, and anything that you plant in the fall. We've got bok choy, great. Amaranth, excellent. Um, we've got random fall seeds. We've got yams, excellent. Um, anything else? There's the rare seeds. We've got seven of them. That is awesome. Okay. Uh, we do have basic fertilizer. Let's get out all of our fish as well to make uh, super fertilizer, right? Um, so we also need sap for that. And here we go. Super fertilizer. Excellent. We've got 22 of them. And now we can make some regular fertilizer as well. Um, zoomy zoom. Okay. It's going to be a lot. It's going to be a lot of fertilizer that we're putting together. Uh, it's six in the morning. Oh my gosh, this is amazing, dude. Okay, this should be more than enough basic fertilizer, um, I should hope. All right, so let's go ahead and get this out of here and get this all set up and ready to go and watered. Um, oops, kind of blew it there, but that's okay. We're going to plant flowers there, so we need eight flowers. Um, and then we need tons and tons and tons of other plants. Uh, let's go ahead and head down here. Uh, we're gonna... Oh my god, my walls just freaking disintegrated everybody. I'm gonna need more, more stone walls as well. But nicely, we've got pomegranates and apples coming in this season. Um, so we're gonna grab up all those. Oh, bollocks, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, we're gonna grab up all those because we need a pomegranate and we need, I believe, three apples. Um, so that'll be good. That'll be real good. Okay, but I need not worry about crap sitting around on my farm right now. The important thing now is to get these animals out and then head to Pierre's to buy some seeds. So let's say hello. Ooh, it looks like the pigs are adults and they are just disgusting looking, everybody. They look just awful. They're monsters. Okay. Um, let's let them all out. And now we head over to the chickens and ducks and rabbits and collect all of their delicious goodies. Excellent. Okay. Bam, 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 and bam. Okay. All right. Awesome. So we are now on track. We're ready to go. We're ready to open this up, hop on horsepower, and head into town. See you later, animals. I will see you tonight. Um, let's go ahead and break this up. We do want to like keep our farm nice and clean uh, But today is not the day to really super worry about that. We will we'll do what we can But it's much more important that we collect all of the necessary seeds. Hey Marnie. What's up? How's it going? I'm, I'm a busy man today or I would stop and say hello. I'm super super busy So Pierre's Pierre's I believe opens at nine o'clock. So we are arriving at the perfect time for this Let's go nice all right, hey guys. All right, seeds for sale. Pumpkins, those are the big ones. All right, let's go ahead and buy a whole bunch of pumpkins. Okay, let's go ahead and get like, I don't know, uh, 90 of them. That sounds good. Let's get 90 pumpkin seeds, okay. And uh, cranberry seeds we need a whole bunch of as well. It looks like we can indeed continue to grow wheat. So I think I might uh, do an area with a, just a ton of wheat um, and that'll be good. I feel like wheat doesn't need to be watered necessarily. Um, we're gonna buy 160 cranberry seeds. I don't know how many we need, but it's a lot. Um, and then uh, we need flowers, so fairy seeds. 
Okay, great. Um, grape starters. Okay, I could do a similar thing with grapes. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Um, I don't know. Let's see. I think I need 12 uh, for each section. So 24. 24 grape starters. Let's just go ahead and buy like 40 grape starters. <laughs> Uh, that'll be fine. 45 grape starters. Let's get one more just to make it an even number. Um, and artichokes. I feel like those are new. Let's buy a bunch of artichokes, shall we? They only cost 30. That's pretty awesome. They take eight days to mature. Okay, that's a whole lot of money that we've just spent. Uh, but I think it's all we're going to need to spend for the moment, at least. I am going to buy more yams, cause, just because I don't have very many. Uh, and eggplants, too. Let's grow some eggplants. Um, do I have any eggplant seeds right now? I do not. Okay, so let's get a whole bunch of eggplants as well. Um, let's get, like, I don't know, 60 eggplants. And this should get me through the summer, I would think. Um, let's get the farm ready to go, and if we have any extra time uh, after that, then then we'll, we'll do something else. But I have a feeling that this is going to take the whole freaking day. Um, so let's just go ahead and get this done and get it going and, uh, and be happy with our choices in life. All right. So put those in, and we need the fairy seeds right now uh, to plant around this guy. So let's get our bees happy, go in with these flowers. And for the flowers, I'm not worried about putting down fertilizer. Everything else is going to get fertilizer, but the flowers, they don't need it. Let's go. Okay. Um, so here, we can pop in and look at this. Everything is still here, dude. Like, we don't have to re... Um, to, uh, to re-ho any of this. And that is really, really nice. All right, so... Fertilizers. We're going to use, because these are our biggest money makers, the cranberries, uh, we're going to go with the super fertilizer for them. Uh, that's going to be really good. Um, five, six, seven, eight. Eh, 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 eh. Excellent. And let's just go across the top here. Great. Now our regular fertilizer is going to be the star of the show for the rest of the day. And it is going everywhere. It's just going everywhere, everybody. No place will escape the 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 basic fertilizer of their nightmares. It's it's it, they, there's no getting away from it. Okay, here we go. All right, I think we're good. So let's put some cranberries down, shall we? I may have bought too many cranberry seeds, <laughs> um, but you know what? I'm happy with my choices. We won't have to buy any more next year, probably. Um, <laughs> but for now, uh, maybe we'll put some cranberries down the middle of where we're going to put the grapes, too. I think that's a good idea. Let's do that. Um, okay, great, 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 everybody. Okay, cranberries are good to go. Um, let's go ahead and hit our basic fertilizer back up. Um, okay, we've also, of course, got this to do. Let's go ahead and get that done. Bam, bam, bam. And I can start turning fish into sashimi again, but I'm thinking maybe I should be saving them, you know? All right. Pow. Pow. And, uh, I blew it. But there we go. Okay, let's get out the old scythe. Nothing there. Excellent. And, um, okay. Yeah, let's go ahead and do some plants here as well. Uh, so let's fertilize. Great. Excellent. And we got a water as well. Sploosh. And here's here comes the big splooshies. Bam. And what do we want to put here, everybody? I'm thinking more cranberries. Let's get more cranberries up here. Okay. And more cranberries here as well. All right. Uh, okay. Here comes the scythe for this. And it looks like this stays year-round? That's crazy. Well, not year-round, but through the season. That is unexpected. Okay. Uh, we gotta get the old hoe out. Bam. And a couple bams here. And get these watered. Excellent. Okay. Bam. And let's go ahead and get the scythe out uh, to handle these as well. Now, what's gonna go in the middle of the corn? 
Um, I'm thinking something else that regrows, like cranberries. <laughs> Let's go with cranberries again. Uh, because this way, oh shit, I forgot the fertilizer. Um, okay, but I can go ahead and pluck these back up. I don't, I don't need to worry about using too many seeds. So let's just go ahead and, and waste those cranberry seeds. It's, it's not a big deal. Um, great, it's all fertilized and now we don't have to worry about replanting anything where this corn is. Excellent, okay, bam, bam. All right, cranberries are good to go. Uh, now, I could do even more cranberries over here, but I'm not gonna. I'm gonna switch from cranberries to artichokes for this top section because I don't think I've grown any artichokes before. Uh, so let's get this fertilized up and throw some artichokes down up in this section. Great, artichoke time. Okay, good, good, good. And we're good, good, good. We're still good and we're still good. Now, rare seeds. Let's put down these seven rare seeds. Uh, we're gonna do it the rest of the way around this. Shit. Okay, I forgot to fertilize those, but I don't want to pluck them back up because I don't want to waste the rare seeds. So let's fertilize there and then put the rest down. Okay, and good. Rare seeds, done. What are we gonna put here? Um, let's go with eggplants. Eggplants sound good. Eggplants, eight of them. Very nice, and now we've gotta hoe this section up. So let's do that. Bam, bam, bam. Okay, all the way down the side. Very nice, and over here, and here, and here. Uh, up this way, boom. These two there, and here. Can I do there? No, I cannot. Uh, I should have just done three there, that's all right. We'll pick up some clay, never hurts, right? Okay, and boom, and bam, and pow, and bang. All right, let's water it all up, and uh, and then we'll be good to go. Okay, I'm just gonna do that, because I blew it. Here we go, splooshies. And here comes another big splooshies. And it's time for, you guessed it, splooshies. Uh, is a splooshy in our future? I don't know, we might have to ask the fortune teller, but uh, you know what, it was indeed a splooshy. And splooshtastic, and I blew it, but there's a big sploosh and a sploosh for, your, for yourself right there as well. All right, fertilizer time. Let's go. All right, fertilizing. Okay. Oh boy, the first day of of fall, everybody. Uh, it looks like the animals are already headed back home. Uh, so once I get these down, I might go close those up, although it looks like they're, they might not be back by the time I finish. Um, down here, uh, we're gonna put yams. Uh, yams? Yeah, let's put some yams over here. Yeah, it's yam time. And yam time, let's do it, okay. Yams for everybody, yes, yes. I'll bet George likes yams. If I still need to make George like me, um, I think yams might be the way to go. All right, bam, 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 bam. All right, that is all set. Now, we've got this to work out, and this is the unwatered area, uh, uh, the, the place I need to water on a daily basis. So we're gonna work with it. I'm actually gonna go ahead and put more space down right here. Yeah, that'll be good. And um, that's gonna be, I think that's gonna be all grapes. I think that's a good plan. Let's do all grapes down the side here uh, for my uh, personal collection. Here we go. And grape starters are next. Great, we're gonna get plenty of grapes from this. Uh, let me go down this side, actually. Four, five, and bam, 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 uh, bammy, 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 bam, and bam. Okay, next up, uh, I need to remember to water. I need to remember to water those. Don't let me forget, dear viewers that I've got watering to do. But for now, let's put down all this fertilizer. And over here, I'm gonna put pumpkins. 
Um, because I know that you can get a super giant pumpkin. Um, I'm not sure what other plants, but I know that pumpkins are one of them. So I want to do these full on nine by or three by three uh, for a total of nine squares to see if I can get a super pumpkin. It looks like I also missed a grape up here. Let's go ahead and do that. And uh, grapey grapes, it's time to get watered. Let's go ahead and do that now. Sploosh and big sploosh. And I can actually also, while I'm at it, go ahead and put one here as well. Let's do that. Bam, and there we go. Grape is down, and we can get a big sploosh. Very good. And another big sploosh. Very good. It looks like I missed that spot. Yes, indeed I did. My watering can is almost empty, so let's refill, and let's get our pumpkins out. Here we go. Pumpkin time. All right, pumpkins. All the way up to the tippy top, and all the way down to the tippy bottom. And back up. And back up, and we missed that one, and it's water in time. Okay, this is great. This is super good. I can also put some stuff up there, maybe more pumpkins. It looks like I've already watered these, uh, so let's go ahead and get that done. Uh, maybe not pumpkins, actually, because we want uh, the best opportunity to get the big one, right? So let's, let's do our best to get that. It's 940. This is good. We should be able to finish this. Uh, uh, right on time. Let's get this fertilized here. There we go. And fertilized. There we are. And what do we want to put here, everybody? I'm thinking um, eggplants. I'm thinking eggplants. Uh, I could also put the amaranth down. Let's put bok choy here, actually. That'll be good. We haven't planted any bok choy yet. It grows super fast, so we'll be able to replace it or just do more bok choy later. Uh, but either way, we're just getting everything all seeded up and ready to go. Let's get this splooshed, and let's get this splooshed. Very nice. And let's go ahead and um, smash this up. And can we just plant amaranth, or do we need to hoe? We probably need to hoe. Um, so let's go ahead and put some amaranth down here. I'm 90% I'm that it doesn't need to be watered, actually. So I'm feeling good about our prospects here. Uh, amaranth. We've got 10 seeds. And let's go ahead and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. And since... You know what? I'm not. I'm just not going to worry about the rest. I'm just not going to worry about the rest. Let's go down to our animals and close them up for the night and end the day. What a day, everybody. What a day. We finished so much. We got so much done, and it always feels so... Hey, chicken. Try, what are you doing trying to sleep, chickweed? Go inside, dude. Chickweed? He's going to hate me to... <gasps> It's a truffle. It's two truffles. Oh my God. Yes. Okay. It's three fucking truffles. Oh my God. Oh my God. I'm the happiest boy in the world, everybody. Oh, I'm so happy. I think we've done it. We can even turn one of those into truffle oil and give it to Mayor Lewis. I cannot believe it, everybody. It's finally paid off. The pigs have paid off. Oh, baby. Okay, let's grab this honey and sell it uh, before we hit the sack because this is our profit for, for many days right now is our honey and our pale ale and such. Um, so, honey, you're going in here and uh, broken CD and um, egg. Excellent. Broken CD goes in here. Other egg up here. Bam, bam. Uh, was that just regular mayonnaise? No, it was indeed golden mayonnaise. And then we've got stuff other than that to just put away. So let's go ahead and do that. Um, I'm going to put my fish in here because I like the idea of turning these into uh, awesome fertilizer. So let's go ahead and do that. We've got some wood, some stone, some clay. Um, we've got a whole bunch more seeds. Uh, hopefully all of this will fit. And it looks like it does no problem. We actually almost ran out of fertilizer, if you can believe that, everybody. That's bonkers. Um, this goes in here as well. And we go inside. Our pale ale is done. So we'll replace that right quick with these hops. Very good. 
And see, pale ale even like it, 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 it brews really quickly. Like it's just so powerful, dude. It's so powerful. Okay, let's go ahead and sell this pale ale, and then we will be good to go. All right, let's hit the sack. And tomorrow, uh, we will do our daily chores, and then we will see what we want to do with the rest of our day. Woo! What a day, everybody. What a day. That was amazing. Um, I think I'll stick one of those truffles in uh, to the truffle oil machine as well. I think that's a great plan. Um, so honey, mayonnaise, and pale ale. Wow. That wild honey, not great from a value standpoint. But I mean, it's, it's not like my beehives are taking up a ton of space that I'd be using otherwise, so... I guess I shouldn't really worry about it, but it's nice to get the, the flower honey. It seems to be a lot, 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 lot more valuable. All right, day two of fall. We, we got everything we needed to get done done on day one, and that is frankly amazing. Um, the weather tomorrow is going to be beautiful and sunny, and the fortune teller says that the spirits are neutral today. It's also Penny's birthday, um, which, I mean, it's not a huge deal if we miss it. We can maybe give her something and be nice. Um, okay. I made you a little treat this morning in the saloon. Dig in, your friend Gus. Pancakes, thank you, Gus, for the pancakes. It's very kind of you. All right, uh, we can sell this mayonnaise, excellent. And we can put this quartz away. Flowers are growing, growing, growing. And here we go. Looks like our cranberries are in real good shape. We're gonna chop this down because it's not gonna grow into a full tree anyway. And let's go ahead and bait up our traps. We got all fish today. That's exciting. Um, okay, and let's water. Sploosh. Everything in here should be good. Everything over here, however, needs a water in, especially these pumpkins. I ah, can't wait. Can't wait for our first pumpkin harvest, everybody. That's going to be cool. Okay, and sploosh. And I blew it. I blew it, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go, sploosh. And I said I don't think that this needs watered, but I don't know, it looks like it might. Let's grow some amaranth, why not? Um, we can water it too, it's not a big deal. To use up a little bit of extra time to get some extra watering in. All right, let's go. Let's head down to our animals and let them out and uh and then move on we'll we'll make some more stone walls today to rebuild the walls that um that broke down uh it's, that'll definitely be on our priority today and just cleaning the farm i think will be a priority today that'll all be super helpful all right in the meantime uh i'm definitely gonna head over to the uh community center today as well because i've got things Excellent, a rock. I found a rock in the ground. How helpful. Um, okay, we've got some, some wool. We've got a duck feather, always nice. Uh, we don't need a rabbit's foot anymore because we found the, the necessary rabbit's foot. Um, double wool today, though. That's amazing. Thank you, bunnies. Thank you, bunnies, for your service. I appreciate it, and I love you. All right, let's open this up. Bam, out you come. There's a pig just kind of chilling out there in the barn, which is... Uh, odd to say the least uh, but now I think we are good to go so let's uh, get rid of this um, we'll get rid of this as well a little bit of fiber uh, we will chop up this very good we will collect our apple we'll also chop that our apple and our pomegranate excellent two things that we are very close to being able to turn in well the pomegranate we can turn in apples we just need one more um, okay, excellent. Chores are complete, I believe. Let's get some eggs cooking in the mayonnaise machine, and uh, and then we'll figure out what to do next. Here we go, bam, uh, bam, and we've got some stuff to put away. Here we go. So, what to put away? Uh, fiber that goes in building materials along with the stone and the wood. Um, fishies go in here. Uh, duck feather goes in here. And eggs, uh, copper. I've got some copper that goes in here. Wool goes inside. Everything else it looks like goes inside. So let's deal with that. Uh, we can get some wool cooking. Here we go. Bam. And uh, just to be super safe, um, I'm going to put two of the truffles away in here while I try to go make truffle oil. 
because I'm worried it's going to take more than one. It does not take more than one. That is perfect. All right. Let's go ahead and grab up this truffle then. Do I need two truffles? I feel like I might. Um, pomegranate can go in the fridge. Do not eat the truffle, Schmer. Put one pomegranate away. Pancakes can go in the box, because that makes sense, right? I've got two pancakes, everybody. Um, great. All right, let's hop on horsepower, and let's head to the community center and turn some things in. We might actually finish some things, uh, maybe. I think we might finish the chef's bundle, which is cool and exciting. Um, but we're not going to finish Marnie's bundle today because we need more apples. Uh, we need one more apple to complete Marnie's bundle, and then we might be done. We might be finished with the community center, ladies and gentlemen. Wouldn't that be crazy and amazing? Oh my god. It would be. It would be crazy and amazing. All right, what do we have? The Enchanter's Bundle. You need a pomegranate, good sir. I've got you. Bundle complete. Reward friendship hearts. Okay. Well, we didn't really need the friendship hearts, but whatever. He'll also give us five gold bars. I'll take them. Chef's bundle. Here comes the truffle. Oh, yeah. Friendship plus. I don't know who's friendship plus, but... And three pink cakes. Excellent. Now, all we need is one more apple. And that's the whole community center, everybody. We're going to be able to do it tomorrow. We're going to be able to do it next freaking episode. Can you believe that? Can you believe it? I, I can't. I can hardly believe it at all. All right. Um, a wild plum. Uh, if I happen to find one today, I'll come back and pick up that quest, Alex. But I'm not sure that I'm going to find it. Uh, all right, George. George, do you like mayonnaise? Does he like apples? He probably can't eat apples. Maybe he likes eggs. Let's give him this silver egg and see what he thinks about that. Here you go, buddy. A gift? Hmm. Okay. I don't know if that's good or bad. Uh, whatever. Whatever, George. We're gonna be friends someday. We're super close already. Just one heart away. Okay, we need Vincent. We need Caroline. Uh, we need a diamond for Willie. We also have Pierre. Let's give Pierre... You think Pierre would like a truffle? I think he would, but I don't want to give away my last truffle, so let's not do that today. Let's give Pierre some... A pink cake? An apple? He might like an apple. Let's give Pierre an apple. All right, Pierre? No, let's not give Pierre an apple. We need that. We need him for the community center. Um, we could just give him a sweet pea. Let's give him mayonnaise. We know he likes mayonnaise. Here you go, buddy. This is very kind of you. I like this. Okay. And uh, we can give sashimi right here. Okay. Caroline, did you like that? Oh, goodness. Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure, Caroline. Um, and she's at nine now. She's still at nine, I should say. Jazz is at a ten. Oh, my God. We've done it. We've completed the jazz quest. Um, Kent, we need to give something to. We'll give him mayonnaise as well. Uh, Pierre, we're still working on. George, we're still working on. Krobus, we're still working on. So we'll give him another horseradish soon. And Shane as well. Um, any other ladies in here need it? No, it doesn't look like it. All right. Enjoy your exercise day, ladies. Uh, I am off. Mayor Lewis, how's it going? Uh, Pierre, did I talk to Pierre? I don't think I did. Let's just have a little chat. You know, I used to be a pretty good boxer back in the day. My right hook was the stuff of legend. I believe you, Pierre. I believe you. I'm sure you are still equally badass. Uh, we need a diamond for Pierre. So let's head home and grab that. Um, and then we also need to give something to probably Elliot. Is Elliot still low for us? Uh, no, we're good on Elliot, actually. That's great. Really nice. We've completed the Elliot quest as well. Although I think that once we get married, that might change. Um, all right, mayonnaise time. Let's go ahead and put these in so that they are ready to go by the end of the day. Bam, bam, bam. Okay. And uh, some bait and some honey and some derg and some wada for derg. I, can I hit it from here? Yes. Okay, good. Uh, excellent. Okay. Uh, what am I here for? I'm here for some horseradish. Bam. And uh, what else am I here for? Anything? 
I don't want to do geodes today. I could put stuff away, but meh. Um, let's go ahead and put this honey and mayonnaise in here. And if the truffle oil is done, it probably takes a while for truffle oil, though. And uh, tomorrow, after finishing the community center... Oh, I can't believe I'm saying that. That's so good. After finishing the community center, um, I also want to go to Robin's and get her started on a shed for me. Um, that would be nice. That would be real nice. So, but for now, let's head down to Krobus, give him some horseradish so he's a happy camper, and see if he's got another iridium sprinkler. That would be really great if he does. But I don't know. I don't know if and when he's ever going to get a new one. There you go, buddy. All right. What do you have for sale today? Uh, yes, I do. An Omnigeode? I'll take it. Excellent. All right. Great. Thank you, Krobus. Um, enjoy your day. I'll bring you more horseradish next week, I promise. And we needed a diamond for Willy. That's what I forgot. Let's go grab the diamond for Willy. Um, oh, man. It's just doing all that. Uh, Kent. Kent gets mayonnaise as well, right? Here you go, buddy. Yeah, I know. I know, dude. Let's chat. Things haven't changed much since I've been gone, except we have a new farmer in town. Yeah, dude, and he's pretty amazing. He's a pretty chill dude, isn't he? And he provides you with your daily mayonnaise ration. All right, back to grab a diamond. We also need to find Vincent today so we can give him something. We'll give him sashimi, and that'll be fine. Because um, we're, we're getting close. We're getting close with Vincent. It's not long now. Uh, before Vincent's fully on our side. All right, we've done it. Let's go back to Willy and uh, and and give him a diamond. It'll be nice when we don't have to give gifts to Willy anymore because he's so freaking far away, dude. He just takes forever to get to, even with horsepower. Um, let's see if we can spot Vincent along the way as well. Vincent, are you here, buddy? Are you at home, perhaps? Or are you with Penny at the library? He is not at home. Okay. So, perhaps he is with Penny at the library. Let's scope in and see if that is indeed where he is. I hope it is. Um, because I don't like wasting time, dude. We got some blackberries. Awesome. There he is indeed. We've spotted him, everyone. Excellent. Vincent, have some sashimi. For me? Wow, thanks. And it's Penny's birthday, so Penny... Have some sashimi for your birthday. I know, I know. I'm too nice. I'm too nice, Penny. Um, okay. Nothing to do at the library, I don't think. So let's head down to the beach and find Willie. Find Willie and give him a diamond. Uh, maybe pick up some stuff, too. Let's go ahead and do that. Pow. Couple of gold ores dug up from the beach? Oh, damn, dude. We're rich. We're already rich. We've got 91,000 G... And we've spent a ton of cash already over the last couple of days. Yes, I know, Willie. Your dad loved diamonds. He was a fisherman, you know. I grew up sailing between the Fern Islands, living from catch to catch. Fishing life is tough, but there's something about it that keeps you going. Yeah, yeah, I suppose, Willie. I suppose. Um, great. You just still don't have anything that I want. Uh, but, Willie, I've provided you with another diamond. How are we doing? How are we doing, Willie? Where is he? Nine. He's at a nine out of ten. Same as George. Oh, we're getting close. We're getting close. I can't believe it, dude. We're going to have the community center done. We're going to have all of these friends that we can tell are the ghost of our grandfather when he comes back on the first day of spring next year. Like, huh, we're actually, like kind of approaching the end of the game. We're over, just over 70 75% uh, done with this game. And one thing, one other thing that we want to do is get married. We got to get married still, everybody. Um, and I have somebody in mind for that. I do indeed have someone in mind. Uh, and we'll probably start that going pretty soon. Uh, but for now, hey, it's Shane. Shane, do you like sashimi? Yeah, of course you do. It's great. You're welcome. Life isn't so bad. At least I have frozen pizza and eggs. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Um, are we at uh, 8 out of 10? We are at 8 out of 10 with Shane as well. My goodness. Oh, everything's going great. Okay, I haven't found a wild plum, so we're just going to pass by that. Let's go back to the farm, and we're going to rebuild our walls. Because didn't I lose some walls to degradation uh, at the end of the season? I think that I did. 
Um, but I don't remember where exactly. Our mayonnaise is also ready to go, so we can put... We don't have any more eggs. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, replenishing our mayonnaise supplies. Uh, we do have some stuff to sell. This clam. Um, these corals. And the mussel is a fish, so I'm going to hang on to that one, actually, uh, to turn into fertilizer at a later day. Okay. Uh, is the truffle oil done yet? I think that's... Oh, God, everything is done. Okay. Blackberries. Um, oh, God, I need to use up these blackberries, because I'm only going to find purple blackberries from here on out. Um, so let's, uh, let's start putting these to use. Let's put the truffle away. Let's put the cake away. Uh, cake, thank you. Bam, bam, bam. And blackberries, blackberry jelly for the whole town. We're going to try to use up all of the blackberries that we can, um, so we can get rid of them. Because we will never find regular blackberries again, everybody. Not ever. So, in fact, let's go ahead and put the blackberries in here for ease of access. And uh, let's pull out this wool because we can get another one of those started right here. Bam. And we can sell that cloth for a fat profit. And we do indeed have our truffle oil that we can give to Mayor Lewis so that he can smother himself in it uh, and make sweet, sweet love to Marnie. All right. Uh, jellies, jellies, jellies. And truffle oil, great. Okay. The Omnigeode goes in here. The gold goes in here. Gold bars and gold ore. The cloth goes in the sail bin. Yes, yes, yes. Excellent. Cloth. And tomorrow we're going to have our third apple. Tomorrow we are going to have our third apple... And we are going to feel real good. Um, I watered these, right? Yes, yes, I did. All right. Good thing you can't... Uh, well, maybe you can overwater, but two waters is probably not too much. Um, let's go ahead and get rid of that guy. Some fiber. All right, I'll take some fiber. Why not? Another truffle. It's another truffle, everybody. We're going to start a truffle oil manufacturing area. This is awesome. This is so good. Close up the old barn. Close up the old coop. And how am I doing on hay? 195, and then... Oh, oh, okay, so it just says out of 720. That's good, okay, cool. Um, I think... I am I need to start thinking about getting this filled. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and scythe up, like, the back end of this, because the animals don't really seem to come to the back end of this. We can also make a little more room. Um, yeah, just like a few little harvests here and there, collecting some more hay, and, uh, and sending it to the silos, because, like, yeah, this is great, and these all, like, will regrow over the course of the season, um, so yeah, like, we can grab a little there, and a little there, a little here, a little here, and then let it regrow, it's gonna be great, it's gonna be really nice, we're gonna have all of the grass that we ever need, here we go, bam, one more swing there. Let's give one swing here. Very good. Let's chop that up as well. Um, can I get this tree with the scythe? Yes, I can. And there is, I believe, more grass. Like, I, I, I planted a bunch of grass, dude. So let's hit that. That can regrow. We, oh, yeah. Look at this, everybody. Grass and grass. Grass and grass. A little bit of grass here. Grass for that ass. And uh, over here as well, and right here, and this, and this, and a tree! A tree for the chopping, everybody. I hope it falls in the direction I want it to. It did. Okay. There we go. Excellent. And there's still a bunch of grass over there. It's 1020, so we got enough time for this. I still haven't rebuilt my fence. Uh, I need to, I, I, I just need to find the spot where it needs rebuilt. Okay, bam. 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 Bam, 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 bam. Yeah, that's good. That's real good. Okay, and that'll all regrow. Uh, we can hit here once as well. Very nice. That was a, maybe a mistake, but you know what? I don't mind. Okay, pow. Yes. Maybe one more swing here. Boom. Oh, yeah. Building up that hay. All right, building materials. We've got fiber. We've got wood. Uh, we do have some seeds here. Seeds and sap. 
And uh, other than that, I think we are good for the evening, everybody. We're finishing just a tiny bit early, and that's okay. Uh, we can sell this cloth. We can also put this new truffle up in the truffle oil machine uh, and get that going. Bam. I hope truffle oil is valuable. I imagine that truffle oil is super valuable. Um, and we might be able to cook some stuff with it, too. Maybe we can make some truffle fries when we grow some potatoes next year. Uh, we're not going to be playing into next year, actually, probably. But that's all right. Let's go to bed and call it a day. And uh, and we'll continue this work in the morning, everybody. In By in the morning, I mean on the next episode of Sundays in the Farm. On the farm. At the farm. With Farmer Schmer. Uh, thank you so much for watching. You know I appreciate it. If you enjoyed the video, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you later. I'll see you around. I will see you next time. I can't wait to play more Stardew Valley. And I can't wait to do it with you. Have a great day. Bye.